Hi guys, this is Shada Monford here. Now two things I want you to do. It's election day, so I want you to share this with anybody who's thinking about voting Liberal and also basically anybody who's going to the polling booths today. If you're at the polling booths today, one, remember that I'm, look, I'm going to be there at one o'clock, I'm going to be helping, I'm going to be volunteering and I'll be scrutineering. So this is going to be a really long day. I go through till 10 o'clock unless there's a recount and then we could be there till midnight. All right, so this is a service I'm doing for you. Remember, all of your volunteers are there for you. So if you're going to a polling booth, don't be rude to the volunteers. They're trying to give you information to help you if you don't need it. And there's been so many people I'm so happy to see that have been prepared. They have what they're going to vote on their phone. They've already researched all the freedom parties. Fantastic, you know, probably 50%, more than 50% of the people that I've been seeing at the, the time I've spent at the polling booths. So good on you for being prepared. And look, 99% of people are polite and do realise that volunteers are there for free doing a pooey job in the rain to help you, to help Australia to try and make a change. So don't be rude to them. Don't make snide comments as you go past. It doesn't matter if you have a different political view that's okay. You just say, no, thank you. All right, because we've had a couple of our, and they always seem to pick on the little ladies. So we had a couple of little ladies there yesterday from the different freedom parties that got really nasty things said to them. We don't want people in tears, guys. They're there to help you, really. And secondly, I think yesterday was interesting because the day before with the pre-polling, we were there, and you can you can generally tell who people are going to vote for. I mean, of course, it's absolutely private and nobody's going to pry. But if they walk straight up to somebody, take a flyer and give them a wink, you know they're going to vote for them. Maybe a little less than a third yesterday were going for the Liberals. And I was just gobsmacked. These look like quite intelligent people. And I was just like, don't they remember what happened over the last two years? Don't they realise that they've saddled Australia with so much debt that they want 250 years with their economic policies to pay it off? You know, at least Clive and um, uh, Craig Kelly have got a, a plan to pay it off in seven years by boosting production, not by cutting costs. These people, I can only think they're, they're voting to protect their jobs. I, a lot of them look like they work in the public sector. Um, in, and, and not in the private sector, so they look like they work for the government, so of course they're going to vote for the government to protect their jobs. But gee whiz, Morrison's already said this, he's going to have to put the, the slash through it. Right? And we're already seeing you know, people in NDIS and aged care. I, I've got relatives who are applying for jobs in, in that field at the moment, and they're all saying, will you take below award wages because... You know, in the future, we don't think there's going to be that much funding. They know. They know these sectors are going to get slashed. We know that the healthcare sector is going to get slashed. We know that police is, are going to get slashed. We know that the Liberals have almost bankrupted our country, apart from just stomped jackboot all over your human rights. And yet these intelligent people are just going straight up to the Liberals and grabbing the, the Liberal how to vote card and going, vote, let's vote Liberal. Really, I, I don't, look, whatever your political alliances are, that's your choice. And I, will, I would defend to the death your right to have your own choice. But think, stop and think about things. Really think it through. Have a look at the record that Morrison has had over the last two years of saying something and then lying and doing exactly the opposite. Saying something, lying and doing exactly the opposite. I don't want that to happen anymore. Don't vote for more of the same. Look, I don't care who you vote for, but please, just not Liberal, Labor or Greens because we want a different system. We actually want a democratic system that is democratic and the only way to do that is by diversifying, getting the little freedom parties in there, making sure that people really have a diverse say in government, right? not that it's just one agenda or, hey, both Liberal and Labor want us to go and join the WHO and give up the right to control our own health system, which is the best in the world. All right? And yet it's going to go down the toilet if we do that. Guys, if you're voting Liberal, please think about this. And today, if you see the volunteers there, just be polite to them. Just say hi. If you see me, give me a little wave. Go hi. Hi, Sh I'm going to be there in the rain.
heavens are going to be raining on us, but our hearts are going to be full of hope for the future. So look forward to seeing you at the polling booths today and um, hopefully you're scrutineering. So if you're scrutineering, I might see you there as well too as a scrutiny later. But anyway, my darlings, let's hope that on the other side we have a better Australia and I'll see you there. Every blessing to all of you.